Well, I guess I sort of started falling in love with music when I picked up my first guitar at about 11 years old. As far as I know, I've been singing probably as early as I can remember. You know it's just your foolish pride, Layla. My name's Andrew Wishart and I'm one of the very fortunate musicians who gets to sing and play on the Indian Pacific. The musicians and singers are on for a week, which encompasses playing on a lot of different platforms and of course off-train experiences as well, where you sing in some amazing places in the middle of Australia. I remember my first uh, trip on the Indian Pacific, I sort of woke up with bated breath because I'd never crossed another wall. And I remember rolling up the blinds and just sitting there for 15 minutes, just blown away by the sheer amount of space. Can't start a fire, can't start a fire without a spark, this gun's were high. One of the stops across the Nullarbor is a little town called Cook. You know, when you get off and do a stop in the middle of the Nullarbor, it's so quiet, it's just nothing. Uh, and hot, <laughs> usually. <laughs> the, the stop at Raw Linna, which is literally in the middle of nowhere, and it's you know, a massive sheep station, and the train stops there, and they get the experience of stepping off the train, and the first thing they see is a row of bonfires, and they see um, all these trestle tables with hors d'oeuvres and entrees, and and uh, you know, the bar set up and then of course myself with the PA and the music set up to sing for them and you can see that it would be in such a remote area and such a quiet area and everyone's in such a happy, joyous mood. It's something that's uh, quite hard to encapsulate. You've got to sort of be there to feel it. I guess one thing that is blatantly obvious is that music seems to be the glue or the gel which binds everyone together. Anything from the 60s and 70s works really well. Can you ever go past Sweet Caroline? Everyone in unison just goes, ba ba ba. Everybody! Sweet Caroline. I guess uh, being on the Indian Pacific is all about the experience of a lifetime, and I think having music and live singing on the train just adds to the experience. Good sports, good sports.